Good morning everybody. It's absolutely horrible out but uh, Maggie's doing a walk so that has to be done and then I'm heading straight back home to the studio to tell you about a new tip especially for you people who live in Dublin. I'm back in my kitchen studio sawing out and I have a new tip for you. So if you already know me, um, welcome back to these tips and if you don't know me, I'm Roisin O'Farrell Irish artist. So I have some really great news if you live in the Dublin area. There's a new shop called Sostren Grina. I'm sure I butchered that. And they have just opened in Dunleary right beside Penny's. And they have a, a range of uh, art supplies. And I have been using their brushes over the last couple of weeks. Um, and this is a selection of them that I picked up. This probably is the biggest one and it cost two euro 46 or something like that, two euro 50. Um, this one is one of the smaller ones and the smaller ones cost something like 76 cent. Like where would you be going? 76 cent is fantastic value. So they are, they're a lovely brush um, and you know, they, they're great, absolutely fine, you know. So definitely if you are, if you live in the Dublin area or if you have anybody local, get them to pop in and just grab you a big handful of them and send them on to you. Um, and also they do different shapes and stuff and they do canvases and they do acrylic and they do crafty stuff as well. So definitely worthwhile checking out. By the way, no endorsement there, I'm not getting paid for any of this. So if you are not lucky enough to live nearby or don't have somebody who can pop them out to you, um, on the budget end of, of brushes, I think that these little brushes are pretty great and they are by Create and Create, they, you can get them in Ireland in any of the main stockers, Evans, Kennedy's, uh, Cork Art Supply, Art and Hobby Shops and they do a range of them in different sizes but they're all pretty small and they're a nice acrylic brush. Um, and then finally, uh, this is my preferred brush, which is the Galleria Windsor and Newton. Now it's an expensive brush. It's a very nice synthetic brush with a nice flat, bright uh, head on it. But I mean, my daughter just got to this one. It's not focusing on it because it's focusing on me, but she's just ruined it. And it, you know, they are expensive. So, you know, if you're the kind of person who doesn't tend to look after your brushes a lot or very well, then, you know, you might be better off using the cheaper ones and then you can sort of replace those as you go along. So that's it for now. I will come back and show you how to clean your brushes and to look after them, but that'll be the next top tip next time. So till then, see you then. Bye.